Hey, what is going on everybody? James Dieter, back with my third or fourth video in a row. I got a picture frame for my autographed picture of Ichigo Kurosaki. I just have to uh, find some uh, nails and nail to my wall. But the hooks are on opposite sides instead of right in the middle, so I'm going to have to figure that out, but I will do that later on. I want to show you the Demon Slayer pop that I found at my Target today. And it has a Target exclusive sticker on it, although it is actually a common. Why are they putting Target stickers on them? I have no idea. But this is Mr. Muzan Kibutsuchi, the bad guy from Demon Slayer. Super, super dope pop. I love his... Oh, I didn't even notice the artwork on the side. That's super cool. Wow, that's awesome. Love his little... Uh, his hat he's got on. This was the only one left on the shelf. And I picked it up on my lunch break. So, yeah. Super, super cool. I wonder if they're going to make his um, little kid form. Spoilers if you haven't watched the... Uh, very first new episode of the new season the entertainment district um, arc yeah this is a the hair mold is super cool kind of looks like Michael Jackson hair a little bit actually the hat kind of looks like a Michael Jackson hat as well actually the whole outfit kind of looks like a Michael Jackson outfit but yeah this is I love how they made his uh, red eyes because you don't see very many Funko Pops with different color eyes um, I'm trying to think. I know Buckbeak from, uh, Harry Potter. I know he has orange eyes, I think. And, uh, yeah, most of the pops have, uh, black eyes. Oh, uh, Kurama from, uh, Naruto. He has red eyes. I'm trying to look at my, looking at all my pops I have sitting here. But yeah, not very many Funko Pops have different color eyes. Yeah. So there you guys have it. This will be a very, very short video. That artwork is really cool on the side. Now, I'm, I'm going to have every common before I even get my pre-orders in from the company that I bought it from. I still can't remember. I think it was Smy that I bought it from. I know it was like, it wasn't a company that I normally buy my pre-orders from because I usually buy them from the Spastics, which I think they were all sold out before, before the time that I got off of work and um, remember to buy them. But, yeah, there is... Mr. Muzan Kibutsuchi, I think that's how you say it. Very, very cool looking pop. I really wish they would do inserts in behind all of the pops. I know only a few, um, a few pops have inserts behind them. I think most of the, um, what are they called? Mandalorian pops have the, the inserts in them. I know the old, uh, Harley Quinn movie had, um, inserts in it. I don't know why they can't uh, pay more money or spend more money to put inserts in them because now we're paying this was actually the first Funko Pop that I bought for $11.99 because I scanned it and said $11.99 so they finally have changed all their prices at Target because my other few that I bought the commons that I bought at Target were $8.99 still Obviously, Cad Bane, he was, um, he was, a, uh, uh, what's it called, a con exclusive, so that was like a, I think that was thirteen ninety nine 99 or fourteen ninety nine. I think, and the Pop Town was 25 I think, and the Harry Potter one was 25 I know, I think, the 10 inch Pops are still twenty nine ninety nine. I think, I saw people posting that they have found the 10 inch Charizard at, at their target, so hopefully, my target will be getting it in soon because I will definitely get that because that's one of my favorite characters. Um, obviously, Pikachu is probably in my top probably three favorite uh, Pokemon characters. I'm not a huge Pokemon fan like all these other people around the world, but I watch a few um, Pokemon creators opening up their um, brand new Pokemon um, sets, and all the cards look amazing. The artworks are super, super cool. I don't know how long it takes um, the designers to come up with the designs of the cards and stuff, but it's really, really cool to uh, 
see what they pull. So, so yeah, like I said, it'll be a short video, and I've already talked for five minutes. So, hopefully, everyone is having a good Saturday today. I am off tomorrow, so I might make another video tomorrow before football comes on. I know there's going to be football on from now until Thursday, I think, because I heard they had to cancel like two or three games because the players had COVID or something. So this will be the longest week with football. So I don't know if everything's going to be televised on TV or what, but I'll have to look into that because I like watching football because it takes my mind off of what is going on in the world. So, so yeah, I hope everyone got their Christmas shopping done. My mom is not very happy because my brother's girlfriend's family is coming over for Christmas, which they said they weren't going to because they were going to Philadelphia, but plans have changed, I guess. So now my mom has to cook more food, and she's out buying presents now for all of my brother's girlfriend's family, which she did not want to spend more money because we were trying to save money this year, which obviously we can't now, so... But, whatever, I will try to make the best of it, since it is the first Christmas without my grandma, which will be really, really sad, and now I'm going to be annoyed with loud-ass kids in my house, which I'm not looking forward to, but I will try to be in the Christmas spirit, although I don't feel the Christmas spirit, which, never mind, I take that back, yes I do, because my amazing friends got me this autographed picture, like I showed you before, and my sword so i do feel the christmas spirit actually and mr brant he said his package will be here on monday so when i get off work from monday i will make a video showing the stuff that he sent me i know one thing he sent me uh a tangero pop with the the hot topic one with with his um uh i forgot what, what that mask was called but that mask that he has on the side of his head that pop looks amazing so I cannot wait to open up that, and yeah, just be on the lookout for that video. So yeah, hopefully you're all having a good day, and I love you all. And until next time, this is James Duda telling you to have an amazing day.